Wish I had an ass like that. I know you know the kind. Ain't really one for working out though. Doing no sweat. sweating in my mind. This is gonna be easy. <laughs> Not at all. Hello, my name is Shannon Costello. I am 26 years old from Rochester, New York. Rochester. I live currently in Los Angeles. Um, my occupation is, I don't really know where it is, but it's, it's out there. I have been a writer, an actor, a model too. And I design and do crafts and thrift. Those are all occupations to me. So that's what I do. It took me 20 solid minutes to figure out what to wear. I hope this all black ensemble is doing it for you. <laughs> Let's start. I'm learning that love is very giving. Love doesn't give up. I think love is sticking it out. That's what I think about that one. Love to me is not a feeling. I think it's a choice. I think you choose to love people and you choose to give love. You choose to take love away. Of course, there are feelings involved. Chemistry feelings, chemistry. emotions, happiness, sadness. All of those things are kind of involved. Yeah, I think it's a choice. I don't know. That's, that's loaded. That's loaded. Okay, so unconditional is clearly without conditions. <laughs> so what's conditional love then? Are we unpacking this? Conditional love is like, I only give my love if you give me your love. Or I only love you if you fix yourself or something. Maybe it's love without illusions. Maybe it's a love with a realness. I don't know. That's all that I have. I've never been in love. I mean, I've been in love with my friends. Does that count? Because I feel like I love my friends and that's mushy. That's really mushy. I've never been in love with like a partner or like anything like that. I would like to be. I don't know why I'm getting, s I just got so emotional, but it's fine. That's fine. Cry it out. <laughs> but no, I've never been in love. Self-love to me is expression. I think self-love is growing, being a better person, learning, expanding, anything that's helping you love yourself so you can love other people. That's such a beautiful statement, true love. True love. I think maybe we fade. I think we fade in our belief in love, in our want of love. Maybe we fade in our choice because I don't think love itself fades. Love is bigger than anything. I think sometimes it just changes. That's a question. Good and bad things were passed down. It'll always interfere with your ability to create meaningful bonds because someone is going to live a truth that is opposite to what your truth is. Love is binary. I don't think so passed down to me, but I don't think so. You know, after living how I want to see the world, love isn't binary, you know? You get to choose what you bring into your relationship. I think you get to choose how you want to view love. Even when your beliefs may be interfering with your ability to create those meaningful bonds, the meaningful bonds outweigh your beliefs because they either lock them in or they shake them up. And I think that's what's like so beautiful about people and about love. 